Hello, my name is Martin and this is 3D Painting Iceland. In this Megabox Monday's video, I'm going to talk about the US Monofilament Nature Works 3D850 High Temp PLA. So let's have a look after the intro. So this is a clear filament, a PLA filament from Nature Works or US Monofilaments called Nature Works. 3D 850 high temp PLA and here on the sticker it says you can print it at 190 to 230 degrees C and room temp up to 50 and normal print speeds 30 to 70 millimeters per second so it's a normal PLA settings for your printer and here they say it's a pure US made high quality nature works in Geo 3D 950 PLA with no added colorants more flexible and durable than standard PLA and you can anneal it at 80 to 130C for improved temperature resistance and you can have a look at the website usmonofilaments.com but let's have a look at the, at the models so the first print I did was this stringing test and as you can see there's a some amount of stringing in the topmost part but very thin, thin stringing and maybe I have to Disable C-Hop for this filament, but the spikes are in good shape and in good detail So maybe just disabling C-Hop should get rid of this stringy, but it's not nothing too serious and The next print I did was this bridging test and this is a really clean bridging test Probably one of the best results I've got with a PLA filament Absolutely no drooping on the longest band even and, and really good and might be difficult to to see the the surface with a clear filament but it's really clean and, and excellent performance in this test and also here with the mr belly model it's it's quite difficult to see with a clear filament but the detail in the letters have, don't have any issues and it's really smooth and and it's coming out really nice and, and no issues a small amount of drooping here in, in this part Maybe maybe you can see it here, a small small drooping, <laughs> but nothing too serious. And this was coming out excellent. Also, my maker coin came out really good, and it's really difficult to see in the letters here because of the clear filament how it comes out. But as far as I can see, it was doing okay. It's just difficult to see with a clear filament because it, it all blends together. <laughs> but here on the back, the logo came out great and this is printed without any infill so you can you can see through the back side <laughs> through the model it's difficult to see maybe on the camera but it comes comes through pretty clear and then printed out the Otis model by Garrett a Chaos Cortex channel and this one came out excellent really smooth back surface here and no stringing to speak of in in, in sheets inside here so this was coming out excellent and I was really happy with the print quality of, of this filament and also with the Omno model by Tessa no, no issues to speak of here and just a smooth surface on the back and, and no issues and no drooping here in, in this area so also difficult to see <laughs> but the last model I did was Sir Layers a lot by the mascot for printed solid and this one came out excellent as well no issues to speak of and, and just looking pretty great and also it's maybe difficult to see because of the clear filament but uh, it, there was no no surface issues to speak of so this one came out excellent so this was my overview of the US monofilament nature works 3d 850 it's a clear PLA filament without any colorants and it was giving me pretty good results I didn't have any issues to speak of with this filament it's difficult to see with a clear filament the, the fine details it's just just a, as the light reflects on the model and, and, and such it's difficult to see but i was really ha happy with this filament i printed at 210 degrees just a normal pla settings in my process slicer and didn't have any issues it's uh, recommended to print at 190 to 230 so 210 seemed to be a good spot for this filament 
but uh, you can have a look at their website usmonofilaments.com it's uh, something you could try out i was happy to to test this filament out and it was uh, giving me good results so this will be it for this episode i thank you for watching and and if you would like to like and share and, and leave a comment that would be awesome and, and subscribe so for now i thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next one